Hey everyone, Steve from Gadget Reviews Expert. We're going to do a review. This is kind of a serious product. Um, if you don't have one, you should seriously consider getting one. This is a, a great product. Um, it's inexpensive and I've used these before and they work really well. It's a uh, carbon monoxide alarm. Okay. And what's really cool about this particular one is actually, and I'm going to just demo it better in a minute, but it does have an LED display that shows you the, uh, the carbon monoxide level in parts per million. Um, it does have some LED indicators. I'm going to go over it in just a moment better, but the green means everything's good. It's going to flash every 30 seconds. The red means that there's a problem. Um, I do want to caution or in, in, um, urge that you read the instructions when you get this thing. It's real important. The instructions are pretty detailed. They're well written, actually very well written um, for this particular product. And basically there's mounting instructions. It does come with the mounting hardware. It's a couple wall anchors, a couple screws, and then there's the mounting bracket. Um, but you just want to make sure it has to be mounted on the wall. You don't want to mount it on the ceiling. It has to be mounted a certain amount of feet away from appliances. Um, a certain gas powered appliances. So if you're putting this in your furnace, it has to be so far away, otherwise it's going to go off. Um, if you have any sort of gas powered appliance or furnace, or you work near engines, um, you, you want to have one of these for sure, if not more than one. There is a description on how you want to mount them throughout the house in the instructions. So take a look at that. Um, it does run on three batteries, three AA batteries. It does not come with the product. These are mine. So let's go ahead and throw these in real fast and take a look at how this thing works. Okay, that's on there. So it's lit up. Sure, this is right here. Okay, here we go. All right, looks like there's a switch in here. So it is on, and it's not. Okay, so it's not. It's on. The blue LED is lit. It's showing the uh, parts per million, which thankfully there's no there's no uh, carbon monoxide right now here locally. Um, District flash uh, once every 30 seconds when everything's working well. The red is going to basically come on when there's a level of carbon monoxide um, that's over a certain level. Um, it indicates the presence of carbon monoxide at the sensor. So remember, you know, it could be other places in the house. So be aware of that. Um, that's about it. Um, it says twist. I'm not sure exactly what the have to go through the instructions on. Um, it says to twist and then off, and I'm not sure exactly what I'm twisting and what I'm shutting off, but I don't know if there's anything in here. Anyway, I'll read the instructions better myself before I work with this, but I just wanted to go over it. Um, if you have any questions about the particular product, I'm going to use it. I usually review the product as soon as I get it, go through the functions, and then I, I test it out for a little bit before I actually write up my review that you'll read along with the video. So any things that I catch that I don't put in the video, please make sure you read through everything. And if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments section below. Anyway, thanks for watching.